Clap your hands, oh you people. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lift your hands and give him praise. Open your mouth. Isaiah, come. Just open your mouth and give him praise. Wherever you are, give him a microphone. Come on, pray in the spirit. Hold up a cup of a shower. Building up your most holy faith, praying in the Holy I am the boy was sick of Pori on my high. A wine, the Kuria, the Kaili Bura City. Yada Matai was selling on my high. I am Mira Kuri Masina Keteli Bahai. A Wakeru a Kabaili was city. I know why Taiburi assigned a Catelia. I yell the bar was seen a Cateli Bahai. Mine a Wuri was seen a Capai. A Diva Tai was seen a Pine Warrior Sikaporia Bahai. A Limpa Liburi assigned a Yamira Taibura Celia Caporia. A Divi Taiburia Cassine. My Adai was Celia. A Pine was Sikaporia. A Limpa Taiburi Bahai. A Divai Cosene Belia. A shot of Mother Bacapaya. A pile of worry was sick and telly behind. A difficult son of a take a pile, a pile more aside. A iroi can tell you behind. A libura seed can tell you. My was cyber a kind of wily. Veronica Solia Capai. A shot of a rua time more a seed. Will leave it a kind of was sick. A pile was selly behind. A shot of a rat behind. My hero was Saika Pori Bahai, a shot of Mother Makapai, Believe what I bore us, a deep Kaporius, a fiber of Taino Walia, a Yapara Katan Wuri Masine, a Falibur Katemo Sonia, a shot of Mother Makapai, the Wari Masaika Pori Bahai, a Falibur of Sine, the Bai the Wine, a Yeru Katan was Sine. My hero, Soma, take a port at the pile, a pile, Yarua, he can know why, and he was silly, but I take a port, my sede, a folly of Barusi, Pirali, a capori of a side, I am Baruma City, a folibu, I call Siri Wadeli, I am Burotene Kerua, a folibu of side, I will sign the Caporia. I live or send the Kateli Bahai. I pour the Atai. Any war of Buri Masini. Yatabir of Solia Caporia. I pour a side Katelia. A shot of Bara. The Pina. The Pina. The Pina. The Pina. I pour him a side Caporia. Billy Connetelli. I buy go Sonny. Any of Bara Katali. Marani Rotai Mosi, I find a war city, a Yapara Kuri, a Limo Sonic Catania, I pour him aside of a heart, in the wild, Mirai Cosone, a Pina Catania, a Yerokonia Bassine, Meliwa Taibu, and the war of city, the boy, a shot of Boda Capai, Mirai Cosonia, a Pina, a Pina, a Pina. A fine reward, a Yabirali, a Tory of City, the Michael Pine Wine, a shot of Barua Tiny, my hero Katema Selly, in the Matai Caporia, a really was psycho for it. I the Pine of Pine, a Liburia Tiny, a Pine of Sine, the Warrior. 
Father, we present the blood. Our confidence is in the blood. We come by the blood. Anya o anya, 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 anya o
Psalm 105, New Living Translation. We didn't plan to start like this. Guys, keep playing. Let's read together while the band plays. Tonight will be special. Shagaba. The glory of the Lord descended on us yesterday. Or early this morning. Or yesterday. Let's read one to go. Give thanks to the Lord and proclaim his greatness. Let the whole world know what he has done. Let's read it again. Verse 1. One to go. Give thanks to the Lord and proclaim his greatness. Let the whole world know what he has done. Wherever you are, begin to proclaim it, tweet it, text it, comment it, proclaim his greatness. Let the whole world know. If you are here, tell somebody what he has done. Tell him what he has done. He saved my soul. He saved my soul. His hand is upon me. Done. That's why we appear tonight. That's why we are on Instagram. That's why we are on YouTube, Facebook, Pixel. Just to let the whole world know. To let the whole world know. Verse 2. Verse 2. Want to go? Sing to him. Yes. Sing praises. Tell everyone about his wonderful deeds. Exalt his holy name. Rejoice, you who worship the Lord. Search for the Lord and for his strength. Continually seek him. Remember the wonders he has performed. His miracles and his rulings he has given. Hallelujah. 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 Bless him. Bless him. Bless him. Let's, 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 let's raise... Let's let's give him some 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 fast tempo praise for about ten minutes. I will sing of the mercy of the Lord forever. I will sing. Oh, I will sing. I will sing. Sing. I will sing of the mercy of the Lord. I will sing, say, I will sing of the mercy of the Lord forever. I will sing, I will sing, say, I will sing of the mercy of the Lord forever. I will sing of the mercy of the Lord with my mouth, with my mouth, with my angel. Thy 
are standing, you are wrong.
testimony. I'm to see me. I'm to see me. He has done it. He has done it. It is done. It is done. Your healing. Your healing. Open doors. Lift him. It is done. It has happened. It is done. It is done. It is finished. It's done. He said it is finished. It's finished. It's done. Shout of praise. Now we're going to fire some serious prayer. But we'll begin in a solemn manner. We'll begin with repentance. I was reading Isaiah 1. And I just thought we should pray from here. And then we're going to bring the map of Africa at some point and prophesy over Africa. A couple of nations in Africa at war. Congo, Cameroon, I mean, and where again? Niger. A couple of them are going to speak the peace of God. But let's read from verse 11. NLT. Everybody around the world, I want you to read this. Because sometimes this is where we get it wrong. We think God is more, in, more interested in our songs, our offerings, our events, our festivals, our conventions. But God wants righteousness. He's a God of justice. There's no point praising him at 12 midnight at hallelujah challenge and at 7 a.m. we begin to oppress men let's read together I want to go what makes you think I want all your sacrifices says the Lord I am sick of your burnt offerings of rams and the fat of fattened cattle I get no pleasure from the blood of bulls and lambs and goats when you come to worship me who asks you to parade through my court with all your ceremony? Stop bringing me your meaningless gift. The incense of your offerings disgusts me. As for your celebrations of the new moon and the Sabbath and your special days of fasting, they are all sinful and false. I want no more of your pious meetings. I hate your new moon celebrations and your annual festivals. They are a burden to me. I cannot stand them. When you lift up your hands in prayer, I will not look. Though you offer many prayers, I will not listen. For your hands are covered with the blood of innocent victims. Wash yourselves and be clean. Get your sins out of my sight. <coughs> Seek justice. Help the oppressed. Defend the cause of orphans. Fight for the right of widows. Come now. Let's settle this, says the Lord. Though your sins are like scarlet, I will make them as white as snow. Though they are red like crimson, I will make them as wool. I want us to go on our knees and just... Ask God to wash us. One of the things we will do this week that I'm led to do while I was praying is we're going to reach out to the widows and orphans. I know we started this thing where we just reach out to our community during every edition. This particular one, apart from paying school fees, we're going to go out and take care of widows and orphans. Let's say to God we repent of religious meetings, of religiosity without spirituality. 
we repent of oppression, you know, on behalf of the body of Christ, on behalf of ourselves. Let's open our mouth because we're going to pray some prayers and we want him to hear us. Open your mouth and pray. God is not interested in our giving in church hundreds of thousands and millions when we don't take care of the poor around us. When we can't even take care of our mates, our drivers, people of low esteem. We spend so much money on ourselves and we are owing those people. There's oppression, there's injustice in the land. Say, wash us in your blood. We repent. We humble ourselves before you. We turn from our wicked ways. As the body of Christ, as individuals, as families. Say, mercy, Lord. Mercy, Lord. Mercy, Lord. Mercy, Lord. Show the body of Christ in Nigeria, in Africa, your mercy. For your word says, if my people, not if the government, if my people who I have called by my name will hum humble themselves. So we humble ourselves tonight. Your word says, call upon me and I will answer you and show you great and mighty things which you know not. We call right now. Show us your mercy. Thirty more seconds. Thirty more seconds. Pray. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Thank you for your mercy, O oh Lord. We receive your mercy. We repent of our pride, our rituals, without passion, compassion for the poor, for the downtrodden, for oppression, for injustice in our land. Put the flag of Africa. Father, we pray for Africa, that righteousness will come down like rain. Amen. We pray for DR Congo, we pray for Cameroon, we pray for the nations of Africa, that Africa is washed in the blood. Amen. We repent on behalf of this continent and the nations of the earth. Show us your mercy. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. Let's stand. Let's stand. Hallelujah. Father, we declare there shall be peace in Africa. Amen. Peace in our land. Amen. Are we ready to pray? Yes. Now we're going to pray some fire prayers. Guys, I want you to help me with sound. Let God have his way in our, village, our prayer sound. Are you ready to pray? We're going to pray based on some revelations I had, and I'll explain it. I was praying this morning precisely the the hour when I asked us to thank God. So normally when I pray, I have my earphones worshiping God and praying. I like to ascend with music, with worship. And sometimes I slip off with the music on a loop. So I was listening to a Thanksgiving song by Terry McCalmo, um, For the Lord is Good. And at some point while I was listening, it felt like there was an interruption, and I heard pilots in the cockpit 
Okay. And they were announcing an emergency landing. As though they were going to land around Lagos or Nigeria. But there was something that happened. And they had to make an emergency landing somewhere around Togo or Lume. I think Lume is in Togo. Right? But what I felt in the spirit was an imminent crash. But we cancel it. Amen. So when I was praying, I woke up and I spoke loud. I don't know if my wife heard me. There was a time I said, there shall be no crash in Nigeria or West Africa. So we're going to pray. Let's go to Isaiah 60. Let's pray with the scripture. That, that verse that says, no wasting nor destruction within thy borders. And then we'll go to Psalm 91. Search it out for me. Tonight is prophetic intercession. What did I say? Tonight is what? In other words, we are praying based on an insight. Want to go? Let's read together. Violence shall no more be heard in thy land, wasting nor destruction within thy borders. But thou shalt call thy wall salvation and thy gates praise. Go to Psalm 91. Give me verse 4. I think verse 4 also. Um, maybe 5. Wasting no destruction at noonday. Is this 6? Go to 6. Is this 6? Somebody help me. I don't want to just think about that. 6. Let's read from four. Let's read from four. Let's read from four. One to go. He shall cover thee with his feathers, and under his wings shall thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and thy buckler. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that fly by day. Six. Nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness, nor for the destruction that wasted and noonday. Lift up your right hand. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. We cancel every wasting, every destruction in our land by reason of air mishaps. We declare no plane crashes in Nigeria, in Africa, in the nations of the earth. By the hand of the Lord, let there be deliverance for everyone flying in this season, in this season. In this season, if it shall not land, it shall not take off. If that plane will not land, it shall not take off. Open your mouth and cry out for mercy. By the hand of your mercy. Raise the banner of the blood of Jesus. We raise this sacrifice tonight to stay any plague in our land.
every international flight the language I heard the pilot speaks was not like English it sounded I'm not sure maybe Arabic or French We're going to pray until we feel a release. Guys, raise the tempo. Cry out for mercy. Let's lay hands on the horn of mercy. Isaiah 60 on the screen, that Isaiah scripture. Father, we declare that violence shall no more be heard in our land, wasting no destruction within our borders. We call our wall salvation and our gates praise. Jesus mighty name as we pray that I heard the name Bisade father I cover Bisade in the blood of Jesus Amen. I declare that the hand of God's mercy locates Bisade right now Amen. Bisade in the name of Yeshua Hamashiach we command deliverance for you according to Psalm 44 verse 3 put Psalm 44 verse 3 for me Psalm 44 I think it's Psalm 44 verse 3 Go to 2. Is it Psalm 44 verse 2? Anyway, just get the scripture that says, Thou shalt command deliverance for, for Jacob. Is it verse 4? We command deliverance. Verse 4, yes, verse 4. Psalm 44 verse 4. Let's pray it again. Thou art my king, O God. Command deliverance for Jacob. Now, I share during come and see. By the way, you should listen to come and see the kind of testimonies we had today. Incredible. A lady shared how her daughter died for six hours. Prayed. I mean, she joins the Hallelujah Challenge. She prayed. Some priests prayed with her and that baby came back to life after six hours. Another one, her daughter's hair was just gone and they said it was impossible. And after the hallelujah challenge, she wrote a request and the hair came back full. Some incredible, you know, testament of faith exhibited by <laughs> some amazing women. So I prayed about a Kelvin and it's, that, that name is coming to me now. We command deliverance for Bisade and Kelvin. Yeah. Say we command deliverance for Bisade and Kelvin and use them as points of contact for everyone under the sound of our voice. Say we command deliverance for everyone connected in the name of Jesus. There shall be no sudden death, no wasting, no destruction in the name of Jesus. Now, let's cancel bone cancer. I'm going to cancel bone cancer. During, come and see, I had bone cancer. Bone cancer. Say in the name of Jesus. We declare that every case of bone cancer is reversed. It's reversed. It's reversed. Open your mouth, clap your hands, stamp your feet and decree. By the blood of Jesus, Anyone with 
bone cancer or any kind of cancer is declared healed we reverse it we reverse it now now Shalom. Why am I here? Shalom. Shalom. The peace of God. Say, Father. We declare bone cancer and every type of cancers healed, healed, reversed, reversed by fire, reversed by fire, reversed by fire. Open your mouth and pray. mighty name there is somebody i heard the word state of the art right now state of the art there's somebody who is embarking on a project and the phrase you have used to describe it you will know who i'm talking about was state of the art state of the art i don't know if it's a building if it's a project if it's a church but you've been using the praise that this project will be state of the art. It is done in Jesus name. It is done in the name of Jesus. Whether you are a developer or maybe something, someone who does projects, but you use the phrase state of the art to describe it. It is done by the hand of God. May I give you a scripture for that? Psalm 44 verse 3, my favorite scripture. This scripture has gotten stuff for me. For they got not the land in possession by their own sword, neither did their own arm save them, but thy right hand and thy arm and the light of thy countenance because thou hast favored them. It shall be done by the right hand of God, by the arm of God, by the light of his countenance and by his favor. In Jesus' mighty name. Now let's pray our three prayers on delay. Hallelujah. 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 See, prayer is important too. Meanwhile, I read them. Um, our friend and sister, Prophet Tiffany, sent me a prophetic word. He said, Hi, Pastor Nat. I'm catching up on the Hallelujah Challenge currently on day two. And I'm watching for a day until I caught. I was watching for, for a day until I caught up. But before I started, I heard the Lord say that this Hallelujah Challenge will break records. Amen. It will break records in souls saved. And, and bef five minutes before I got this in, um, stuff from her, I just looked at the report of souls saved yesterday. And yesterday's broke record. So I was going to come to share that before I saw her, her message. Amen. In encounters, in hearts turning back to God, in revival fires started in regions all over the world, it will break evil records that have kept people bound for generations. The judge of all judges uses his gavel to break all evil records. The Hallelujah Challenge will do this. I also had a vision. I saw one of the days you do this field with children dancing in the studio. Amen. Maybe we'll bring children here. But I also saw rain of babies. The day you, I told you that this hallelujah challenge, day five, I will rain babies. We receive that word. We believe it in Jesus' name. Let's pray the prayer against delays very quickly. Then we'll take the altar call and every other thing. Are you ready to pray?
Daniel 10, 14, you know the story. We won't read it, but Daniel was waiting on God for a revelation. But the prince of Persia withstood him for 21 days. But God sent reinforcement to dislodge the prince of Persia. Every prince of Persia delaying your answer shall be dislodged. They shall be dislodged. Say, Father, we call forth judgment against any power, any force, any demonic spirit, an agent of the devil responsible for unnecessary delays in the lives of God's people. Right now, in the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray. Father, we call for judgment against every withstanding force, every resistance, sponsoring delays in the life of your people. Open your mouth and pray. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Say, Father, send your warring angels to dislodge any power, any force, any demonic spirit, an agent of the devil responsible for unnecessary delays in my life, in our lives. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth. Send Angel Michael your act warring angel this lodge anything in the hell in our families in our lives we activate angelic intervention angelic assistance mighty name. I'll add one more. Numbers 13, 31. Numbers 13, 31. Sometimes it's not a demon. Sometimes it's not the prince of Persia. Sometimes it's our mouth. If the devil cannot stop you, he'll try to stop you through your mouth. I told you when I'm reading, give me the KJV. Accept and otherwise. Don't delay me. Okay, NLT. Go to NLT. Let's read this. One to go. But the other men who had explored the land with him disagreed. We can't go up against them. They are stronger than, than we are. You see? They used their mouth. And they did not go up. Say, Father. Father. Anyway. Anyway. Every way. I have sponsored delay by unbelief and by the words of my mouth. I declare mercy by the blood of Jesus. I reverse every word of doubt, of disbelief, of fear, of panic, of anxiety, of complaining. In the name of Jesus, I declare it is possible. I can do all things through Christ that strengthens me. Open your mouth and pray. Say it is done. It has happened. 
God is able. I agree with everything God has said about me. I declare that his promises are yea and amen. Say God's promises for me are yea and amen. Say it. God's promises for me are yea and amen. God's promises for me are yea and they are amen. I declare with my mouth that God's promises for me they are yea and amen in Christ Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Finally, we are going to declare that that which is to come shall come. Amen. Hebrews 10, 37 amplified. Let's read that scripture. One to go. Amplified, amplified. One to go. For yet in a very little while, he who is coming will come and will not delay. We've said there that this original scripture speaks about what? Jesus. But we can borrow a principle from there. You know, whatever that he means to you. Amen. The Bible says in Genesis 21 that God visited Sarah, as he said. So that was him coming. So who, whoever is to come, whatever good thing is supposed to happen in season for you must happen. Say, Father, who is supposed to come must come. What is supposed to happen in season in my life must happen without delay. Open your mouth and pray. Speedily. Speedily. That helper that is supposed to come must come. That approval that is supposed to come must come. That promotion that is supposed to come must come. That baby that is supposed to come. That husband. That wife. That provision. That assistance. That scholarship. That house. That breakthrough. That is supposed to come must come. Without delay. Speedily. We pray for speed. And restoration in Jesus mighty name we have prayed say father we thank you because you've heard us in Jesus mighty name I've been chanting this scripture since morning I had to memorize it Isaiah 44 verse 25 Isaiah verse 44 verse 25 let me declare it he frustrates the tokens of the liars he, he makes diviners mad he turns their wise men backwards and he make their knowledge foolish I release that word into the atmosphere. Let it go back and accomplish that which to which is sent. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Amen. Now, this is a special time. If you are not born again, this is a very special time. It is a highlight of the Hallelujah Challenge. Every time I go back, I request for the data. To see how many souls are saved. Because that's an offering that we give unto the Lord. God really wishes that no man would perish. It is so important to him that he sent his only begotten son. John 3.16 For God so loved the world. So loved. Not loved. So loved the world. That he gave only begotten son. Actually God became a man to die to save you that's how much he loves you behold what manner of love the father of what has bestowed upon us that we should be called what the sons of God God does not play with love he is love and I want you to know that he has sent me to tell you this a lady joined the challenge today she'd been joining since 2017 and dancing only truly got born again in 2022. May that not be your story. Amen. What shall it permit a man to dance and even have breakthrough? You know you can have a miracle and still go to hell. Oh yes. This is not about blessings. This is about Jesus. And all you need to do is to believe in your heart that he's the righteousness of God. And you take that righteousness and forsake yours 
then confess with your mouth his lordship and you will be saved. Something will happen. Something will happen. Something will happen. Something happened when I met Jesus. He will come into your heart and change the story. So say with me, Lord Jesus, I come to you today. I believe you are the son of God. I believe you died. You rose again just for me. Thank you. I acknowledge I am a sinner on my way to hell in need of salvation. Save me. Wash me in your blood. Break the power of sin. Come into my heart and have your way. Right now, I confess you as my Lord and Savior. And I declare, I am born again. I am brand new. I no longer belong to Satan. I belong to Jesus, my Lord and Savior. In Jesus' mighty name, I have prayed. I declare everyone who has prayed that prayer saved to the uttermost. Amen. Welcome to the family of God. Next thing you do, help us go to www.hallelujahchallengelive.com slash newconvert or scan the barcode. Please fill the form. That is very important. What, what, when we are done with the challenge, we send you, you know, a message and we hold a few classes to help you become established in the faith. We send you a Bible and some publications free of charge. Amen. Now it's time to partner with us. You want to partner, you want to sow a seed, you want to bless what God is doing here, or you just want to, you know, just plant a seed here. Remember, your tithe belongs to your church. We don't receive tithe. We don't receive tithe. Let me say that again. It's for the local church. God has a system for that. So, don't deprive your local church. All right, Hallelujah Challenge is not a church. You know, well, they say where two or three are gathered, but it's not a church in that sense. We don't have the structure of a church. So, please give your tithe to your local church. But if you feel led without compulsion, without cohesion, you want to partner with us to, to make this ministry continue and, you know, make impact. The impact of Hallelujah Challenge is felt globally to the glory of God. So, go to hallelujahchallengelive.com slash partnership. You will feel a little form. It's not hard before you read, you know, the, the disclaimer and all of the legal stuff. It's not, it's not anything complex. And then the account details will show up. I have good news for you. Apostle Joshua Selma will be here on Saturday night into Sunday. You better clap. If there's somebody that I know who carries the grace for breaking delay, you know when he speaks about restoration and speed, is this man. So, he's coming, he's going to be loaded, he's flying from Zaria that day, just because of us. Celebrate. And I, I, I just love Apostle, just like that. There's nothing anybody can do about it. Amen. An apostle must hear of it. Take your journals. Amen. Wave it. Have you been blessed? The Lord has done it finally. You are prophesying. The Lord has done it finally. The Lord has done it finally. I will eat your wedding jello rice. Your wedding jello rice finally. Your baby has come finally. The approval has come. You are walking in glory. You've completed that project. You better smile like it has happened. The Lord has done it finally. Father, as we have declared and danced and spoken, so shall it be. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name.
please make sure you watch the come and see testimonies. It's on my page and on YouTube. The one of today. You will know that God is real. Amen. And we'll have another one later today. If you have testimonies, please fill the form. We want to hear those testimonies. They are faith boosters. They replicate other testimonies. It creates like a, a portal of 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 a testimony. The, the, the Bible says that the testimony of Jesus is the spirit of prophecy. So that atmosphere, that portal replicates testimonies. Amen. Thank you to Simon Cooper's our legal partner, Show Gear, iFix, Carol Films, Evently, Premium Trust Bank, Zenith, Instagram, Facebook, Mixer, YouTube. We appreciate you all. And feel free to patronize them and just, you know, they make our work easy. Amen. When you hear the sound of the trumpet, shout hallelujah. Remember, we are releasing what? Incense from the earth, from around the world. you see you on day nine day nine is the number of what you people don't know fruitfulness